This is an ABC 10 News update. Good morning, I'm Jim Patton with this ABC 10 News update. A scramble for thousands of Southwest Airlines passengers after hundreds of flights were canceled over the weekend, including a number here in San Diego. The airline blaming weather, traffic control issues, and staffing shortfalls for the cancellations. As of this morning, there were already several more flights, both arrivals and departures, at the San Diego International Airport that were either canceled or delayed. Well, city and state beaches in Huntington Beach will reopen to the public today. Beaches have been closed this past week due to that oil spill. City says it hired an independent contractor to perform water quality tests of the ocean and wetlands. The contractor tested 40 different sites and reports it did not find significant levels of contaminants associated with the oil in the water. Well, this smoke and fire wasn't part of the haunted trail at Balboa Park. Firefighters got to the scene on Juniper and Balboa around 3 this morning, found a trailer used as part of the haunted creation was on fire. Fire also spread to some nearby brush. Fire crews were able to get it under control in about 30 minutes, and there was no word yet on the extent of the damage that caused that fire under investigation. Certainly looks spooky with all the smoke and I know. stuff there. I'm curious how long it took them to realize that it right. wasn't, you know, the fog machine. Right, right? exactly. So, uh, yeah, I hope everything's okay over there. All right, it is going to be a cooler and windy day. 60s for the coast and inland neighborhoods today. 50s in the mountains and 80s in the deserts. That's about 5 to 15 degrees cooler than yesterday. And the wind will be picking up through the day. Coast and inland neighborhoods, we're looking at westerly gusts anywhere from 20 to up to 35 miles per hour. Mountain areas, stronger winds up to 70, while the desert areas could see gusts up to about 50 miles per hour or so. The winds will be picking up into the afternoon and evening, calmer the rest of the week, and warming up by the second half of the week will be about 5 to 15 degrees warmer with 70s and 80s returning. Jim? Megan, thank you very much. And for the latest news, weather and traffic, go to 10news.com or download our free 10 News app in your app store. For ABC 10 News, I'm Jim Patton.